Hello. Good morning. It is the next day. I didn't end my vlog yesterday. I'm at the grocery store with my dad. And we're... I'm, I'm kind of craving kids' cereal, if I'm honest. Also, they have Weetabix here. Thought that was a British thing. Didn't know it was an American thing. As well. Oh god, my chest. I'm having chest pains this morning. Um, mm. Decisions, decisions. Mm. I'm kind of sick of Golden Grams. Honestly, I kind of want Captain Crunch. Well, they have these big ass bags of cereal for $3.99. That's cheap. Fruity crisp rice, frosted blah blah blah, crisp berry crunch. I think I'm gonna go. Oh, here we go. Captain Crunch, crunch berries. Original. I think yes. I think yes. I got up at the butt crack of dawn this morning because I had an appointment at 8.30 that my dad so kindly took me to. And I will explain what that was for in a minute. So yeah, as I was saying, there was a guy walking by me. <gasps> How cute are these? Um, as I was saying, I was at a doctor's appointment this morning. It was, it was like a class to learn about sleep apnea. And they also gave me like this carrying case of stuff to take home that I need to attach to my body when I sleep tonight. I'll show you guys when I get home, but I'm currently looking for some glitter nail polish. <laughs> um, but yeah, also I know I keep doing this, it's because I'm having, I swear the lady that was teaching the class, she thought I was going to have like a heart attack. She was like, okay, she stopped the class, she's like, what's going on here? Are you okay? And I was like, yeah, I'm just having, she's like, are you having pain in your, in your left arm area? And I was like, yeah. And I think that means, like, you're having a heart problem, which, Lord knows, wouldn't be a surprise for me. Hang on, I'm gonna test out some nail polishes. Hello! So, it is much, much later now. Um, last I spoke to you, I think it was like 10 a.m. maybe? And now it is a little past 4. I had a little sleep when I got home from the store. I was... I think I fell asleep around 11.30, woke up at like 3.30 or 3, so I'm a little worried because I hope I can fall asleep tonight. It's especially important tonight because I am I have to like monitor myself sleeping with the stuff that they gave me. I'll show it to you um, before I go to bed, like all the little wires and things that I'm supposed to be hooked up to. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, so I'm kind of worried about not falling asleep, but, um, <laughs> I finally fixed my bed. Something about fixing my bed just makes me feel more like the day has started. I guess it's true what they say about, like, like, I guess there is an actual point to fixing your bed. It just tricks your mind into thinking, like, no, you're supposed to be awake, not asleep. Um, but having said that, I'm going to take a bath. Um, I was planning on taking a bath later tonight, but I'm just going to take one now. But, um, yesterday was just really cool, you know, I didn't think anything was going to happen. Like, I had an essay to write in class, and like, you know, we already celebrated over the weekend, so I wasn't thinking anything of it. And then it started out being, like, surprisingly cool because Dalton came over, and it didn't even really occur to me, like, oh, it's my birthday, we're going to be spending my birthday together. I was just kind of like, oh, he's coming over, like, usual. But it was really cool, like, getting to have him here, and what really made it feel like my birthday was that, for one, he gave me a card, which we never give each other cards. We give each other gifts, but, like, we never give each other cards. But, speaking of, I think it's right here. I showed it last night, but here's better lighting. Look how cute <laughs> I'm covering the sun. He's adorable. Um... But yeah, so we were hanging out, and then what really made it feel like my birthday was <laughs> my dad surprised me, and my, not just my dad, it was my mom's idea, but my dad went to pick it up. Um, and they got me a cake, as you saw, and the pizza, and it was just really sweet, like it was just a cute little little celebration, I wasn't expecting anything at all, because it, it's not like a big birthday of mine, I'm only 22. I don't know about you, but I'm feeling 22. Everything's gonna be alright if we're gonna eat some stew. <laughs> Does anyone remember that from Zoe's vlogs? 
I sang that last night um, to Dalton because he brought up. He's like, isn't there a song about being 22? But, um, yeah, I just wanted to say... And then, you know, people texted me saying happy birthday and stuff. So thank you to everyone who was very sweet and um, just was kind of a part of my birthday in some way. Um, and thank you to Dalton for coming over. Of course, it was very nice to be able to spend my birthday with, with a friend. Um, and, you know, my parents, obviously, for being so sweet and going the extra mile. Um, but yeah, that was a really, really long clip, I think. It was, it felt like ten minutes, but it was like three minutes. But, but, um, I'm possibly gonna get in the bath. And I will show you if I, cause Lord knows if I'm getting in the bath right now, I'm gonna be using one of the bath bombs my sister gave me. So, if I do take a bath, I will show you what bath bomb I use. Hello, so... I just washed my face and I'm gonna hop in the bath, but I thought I would choose a bath bomb first. Ooh. There's this one, I think this is the Northern Lights bath bomb. Look how pretty it is. Hmm. I don't wanna get this everywhere. Ooh. Ooh. Here's the, uh, I don't know what it's called, but the bubble bar with a bell. And then, I think I'm going to save, well, I only have one bath melt, so I'm saving the bath melt. And then, I'm thinking, this is, oh, this one's strong. Whew. Um, this is Dragon's Egg. There's a little, look at that, there's a little thingy in it. What was that? Um, whoop. These are a bit messy. Ugh. That's what the box looks like. <laughs> so yeah. Um, ah! I don't want to break them. They're so delicate. I'm debating between this one because I can use this up to five times apparently. So I was thinking of just breaking off a tiny little part of the star and then... Because I know you're supposed to swish it around but I don't want it to get wet and then it'll be wet off to the side of my bath if I just break it that way. You know just not as messy um I don't know why I touch everything to my nose um that smells kind of similar no it doesn't never mind <laughs> I think I'm gonna go for oh I can't decide hmm what do you think guys this one I think I am going to do a little bit of this one. So we'll see how much it looks. So I have broken off two ends of the star. It's no longer a star. But look. Mm. I got some candles lit. Oh, it's making it pink. And bubbles. Oh, a little bit goes a long way. I will say, my hand feels very soft and nourished now after crumbling that the bag. But look! It's pink! It has a hint of pink. I'm gonna get in the bath now. Okay, so like I said, I was going to show you guys the setup for this whole sleep apnea test thing. I have, I can't really see, but um, this is like a monitor thing and it measures the movements of my like body, like if I'm sitting up, if I'm standing up, if I'm laying down, if I'm laying on my side, blah, blah, blah. This is a heart monitor thing attached to here. Um, this is like, I think it's called a cannula or something. You know, you oftentimes see this used, um, for oxygen tanks and stuff. And then these bands right here are to measure, uh, or like to measure the up and down movements of my chest and stomach. Uh, I have another one down here on my stomach. So yeah, uh, definitely kind of weird. <laughs> 
the funny thing is I grew up playing like imaginary games where sometimes I'd be playing the cop or the doctor and the patient. So I would pretend to have one of these things um, on my nose by like putting a cord <laughs> across my nose and now I actually have one. Super duper weird. But um, I'm going to go to bed with this stuff on and yeah this actually isn't on. I'll get this figured out but I'm gonna go to bed. I will see you guys tomorrow. Good night. Also sorry the vlogs still aren't up. I just felt like having a chill ne Netflix day today so that's what I did. I will see you tomorrow. Good night.